All right, let's see who made the reading today. Gemini. Okay. Two. Let's see what's going on with Gemini this week. I have David Bowie stuck in my head, and the song that I have stuck in my head is oh God, what is the name of that song? It's the one. It's the one where he's like, "This is major talk to ground control." You know that one? All right. So uh, anyway. What's going on for Gemini? So you can be receiving messages right now from like, I don't know, space <laughs> or something. Or just like messages that are like, yeah, you're getting ideas for something. Possibly about some sort of travel situation here. All right, so. We have ship, maritime adventure, nautical journeys, sailing vessel. You could be planning some sort of cruise or some sort of like vacation. You could be looking into options about how you can make this happen financially. Winding path, curving trail, twisting route, meandering passage. I'm feeling like a U-turn vibe, like something has suddenly changed with something bench. You're thinking about, you know, relaxing and getting into, I'm getting like home cooking. You could be soul food energy, right? Okay, so living room, comfortable space, family gathering. So you could be hanging out with family or you're going to be in lighthouse. Like I said, there's something changing. There's something there. You're getting some sort of inkling to do something. Okay. Someone has the nickname princess, like they, they're called a princess or like your significant other calls you princess. Or prince or like someone was just listening to, I'm just getting prince, princess. Someone like watches over you very carefully. I don't know if they're more of like a, if this is a spirit or if it's something about a lighthouse is important. So I don't know if this person used to live by a lighthouse or they're like, or if it's a passed away loved one, it's like their ashes were spread at a lighthouse or something. This could also, you could be connecting to someone that travels by sea a lot. Like, I don't know if they're like a captain of a ship or if they work on a ship or if they work at, on the coast. Okay. What's the overall energy for Gemini? I'm also seeing like a bench that you used to sit on a lot as like a child and like wait for something. I don't know if this is at school or if this is just like in general, like you used to just go to this particular bench and hang out. Okay, so awesome. So the overall energy for you, Gemini, is the devil in reverse, which is great, especially paired with the 10 of wands. So this is getting over like a pretty difficult time here and the wheel of fortune upright. So you're really experiencing some good luck right now. Things are coming in. You could even be receiving a lot of money. Okay. You're at like a turning point. You're you're just about to achieve a goal or you have achieved a goal. Okay. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. There's some sort of imbalance with family, but I feel like this is changing. The Sagittarius Capricorn energy. A lot of Capricorn you could be dealing with one actually, or you just released a Capricorn, like, or you're no longer dealing with a Capricorn. All right. Oh boy. All right. So I'm getting like either two friends 
two sisters something here where they one of them may have been a bit shy like they they appear to be shy um but they were like somehow working against you here and there's a queen of pentacles this could be someone at work in the reverse who was kind of messing around in your energy here okay what were these people doing or are they doing or this could be coming up too i don't know okay so think how it resonates guys okay there you are gemini yeah they were trying to cause you to like not be able to it's like they were trying to manipulate you into making some sort of decision you didn't want to make what's this lovers this could be a better relationship yeah Okay. For some of you, they're like convincing you to stay with someone, even though you kind of, part of you wants to like get out of something. Because you know something here or you know some sort of secret. I feel like you received some sort of download during the new moon, which was yesterday, by the way. So, or something just happened. What's the high priestess? Okay. For some of you, I'm getting like they someone here just like randomly. All right. This is like really specific, but like it's like they waited for you to go away or like be unavailable in order to plan something. Whoever these whoever these people are, they they are not your friends. Okay, I don't know. They're like. There's something unhealed and weird and wicked about these people. And like, they just, I don't know if they just don't like you or what. It doesn't really matter, but I'm kind of getting, you're kind of getting over whatever this is. It's like, you knew this was going to happen anyway. It's like, you absolutely knew this was going to happen. And I feel like you're just, you don't even really care anymore. I mean, part of you does, but you're still kind of like, whatever. Yeah, okay. I kind of, I'm seeing some sort of breakup here. Yeah, okay. Okay, what else is coming in for Gemini here? What else is coming in? Yeah, I feel like whatever this is, you know, inevitably is going to give you some sort of powerful new beginning here. Um, so you're going to receive mental clarity with this situation soon if you're feeling currently scatterbrained. But I feel like, you know, this was for the best, Gemini, whatever this was. Okay, this was for the best. Yeah, this was what I was looking at. Um, you need to be courageous, you know, like wait this out. It's going to get better soon. Whatever this is that you're currently feeling. Um, this is, you know, wounded warrior. This is definitely, you need to be resilient in this situation and not give in to whatever mess this is. Like these people just suck. <laughs> they really suck. Uh, yeah. King of swords. Um, what's going on in the relationships for Gemini? Okay. Yeah. I feel like you're breaking free from a relationship. Um, 
you knew something was going to end anyway. And I feel like whatever this was made you overly emotional to the point where you didn't even recognize yourself anymore. This, whoever this was, they just refused to work with you anyway. It was like always a struggle. It was always a struggle. Okay. Is there anyone new coming into Gemini? Anyone new coming into Gemini? Yes, absolutely. Um, this could be an Aquarius here with Uranus energy. Okay. Or this is just you going on your own path for a little bit, maybe exploring, traveling. This is a new beginning. This is a free spirit. Like, I feel like you're just going to be totally unbothered with whatever's happening. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, you're just like, what the fuck ever? You know, after a period of introspection here, definitely, you know, you will be going through a little bit of a dark night of the soul, it feels like, or you are currently. But after a period, I want to say in like a week, you're going to be feeling fine. Yeah. Hanged man. Yeah. Ten of pentacles reversed. Three of swords. Temperance of reverse. There was just some balance. You were, you were in the same respect feeling as restricted as the, whoever this was that you were connecting with, you know, and they just couldn't get their shit together. So it's not a big deal. This could be Aries. I'm also getting Taurus and uh, another Gemini or Pisces. I feel like at one point you did share a connection with this person and it was quite nice. But you guys just didn't have the same values here, okay? You just, you just didn't. What next is coming in for Gemini? What next is coming in for Gemini? Ooh. Oh, yes. Okay. We have a Cancer or Leo coming in. Um, this is going to be some sort of faded, new, passionate partner for you. Okay, you're going to feel really good. Um, ooh. <laughs> this person is going to run toward you too. Like they really are going to be very into you. You're going to feel no sort of weirdness with this person. Like you're just going to, this is just going to feel really good. Whatever this is. Okay. Do your thoughts need a reboot? Yeah, I, I feel like they do. Can I get some uh, advice for Gemini, please? Can I get some advice for Gemini? I'm really hoping this person didn't cheat on you with two different people. I'm definitely seeing Capricorn and Aries. I don't know. They suck. If that's what happened, they suck. <laughs> okay, so... Can I get some advice for Gemini, please? And you know what it is, too? It's like, if they were connecting with this, with these two people, like, they were, these people were somehow able to attach. I was just talking to someone yesterday, and they were talking about energy cords, and I know about cord cutting and all that, but, like, these people, if they were ever jealous about you or sending you energy, that's why you were feeling so fucking weird. You know what I mean? Okay, so we have live your life with both feet in, commit fully to being here. You can need to like kind of disconnect from, you know, this energy in general. Check in with your body and release tension. What are you carrying? So self-care is really important right now, Gemini. Just like totally give yourself the permission to relax and sit with yourself and heal. Okay, thank you. Bye.